So I got to compose myself here. <laughs> so Jeremy just got off of the stage, and um, so my arms were shaking. I was laughing so hard. I'll take that. <laughs> so Jeremy, thanks definitely for sharing. Now, you're, you're in Cincinnati now, originally from St. Louis, right? Uh, actually, originally from outside of Columbus. Outside of Columbus. Yeah, I was just uh, I was doing the East Coast stuff the last two weeks, and Brian asked me if I'd stay around and do this, so absolutely. Awesome, awesome. So tell us a little bit about yourself. Obviously, you are very, very funny, uh, so it sounds like you've been doing this for a while. Um, and earlier, we were, we were talking with one of the other comics, and you were really kind of sharing some insights and information on delivery. Uh, so, so it's obvious that you are a student of the game. Yeah, I, I mean, I think it's like anything else. You do something long enough and you just pick up little things. I think especially with what he was asking me, um, sometimes other people can pick up something that, you know, because he was trying to tell a story, and I think when you're trying to tell your own story, there are things you think are relevant that probably don't fit into a joke. Whereas, you know, if I was telling it to you at your house, you'd be like, oh, that's fine, your cousin's in that story. It's not relevant, but whatever. Whereas on stage, you can just cut the cousin out because it doesn't relate to the overall arc of the story. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. So how long have you been studying comedy? A long time. Uh... Probably professionally uh, about 10 years now, wow. um, and then there were some years before that where I was, you know, starting out. Uh, but I mean, the weird thing was I didn't study comedy at all until I started doing it. My first time in a comedy club was on stage because um, I came from a music background. Okay. And when my last band broke up, I uh, didn't want to deal with four people anymore, so this was the next <laughs> logical yet uh, ego-inflating step, I suppose. Right. Opportunity to still be on the stage. Yeah. And you can still wear all the Claire's gear. Yeah, yeah, I can still wear all my <laughs> junk. All the, as the girl said to me last night, wow, you wear a lot of accessories. <laughs> oh, so, so I've gotten something similar to that in the past. You know, I've gotten the metrosexual, so anyway. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. This is, a, I, this is some weird hybrid of that, and I don't know. What, you that, take a long time to get ready is what they... <laughs> <laughs> So, Jeremy, once again, we, we really, really enjoyed your comedy. Uh, let folks know how they can connect with you across the web, where you're going to be performing next. Obviously, you travel around the country, so how can people keep up with you? Um, my website was actually just redesigned okay. uh, by my friend out in Denver, so jeremyessick.com. That's E-S-S-I-G. That's how you spell the last name. And then uh, it's the upcoming. I'm in, in Chicago this weekend, mm -hmm. uh, Des Moines, Iowa the weekend after. And uh, I guess the closest to kind of our area uh, next, I'll be in Dayton uh, the third week of March. Awesome, awesome. So is this full time? This is very full time, yes. If yeah. this doesn't work out, there's some bills that we go on pay. Yeah, well that's good stuff. Uh, here at Cyber Media and Publications, we showcase, spotlight, and wholeheartedly support entrepreneurs. Uh, and I can tell that this is your entrepreneurial vision, passion, and mission. That's way better than I would have phrased some dumb thing I started doing for free drinks. <laughs> <laughs> We can go with that, too. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy, we appreciate you, certainly, for headlining uh, the first comedy clash uh, down here at Funny Bone Newport on the Levee. Uh, and we're going to hopefully keep in contact with you. Absolutely. Yeah, so that we can connect across the web uh, and potentially catch some of your other shows here in the local and regional area. Great. Jeremy, thanks so much. Thank you. All right.